it's like if you go through the, you know enormous traffic here and come in here <laughs> by the time because of road repair bad infrastructure and so on so by the time we're going back it can take a little bit time what we are going through now will be resolved we are going through a historical phase of the country that is promising and holding the promise for you. It's, no, there's a leadership on the line. And you have to live with that for now. Protest will solve the problem. Will it? So what is going to solve the problem? The problem is replanning. Be responsive. Be able to get engaged with you. So that you will see the problem that we are facing. That's it. Oh, sir, don't you think you, our leaders, have failed us? No, uh -uh. Please. No. Please, please hold on. Don't please hold on. Please, please. Let's, let's, we are talking. Actually, why don't you appeal to us whenever you want, let, we want to vote? Let, let, when I, no, please kindly hold on. This is a the dialogue me. between the youth. Get into this debate. Okay. Sir, I'm so sorry. When I'm tired, I cut off. Okay, sir. What is your question? No, sir. We are here. Yes. We held on to a lot of promises from yes. the change agenda. Yes. We believed that the leader, President Buhari, was going to come here, was going to come on board and change our lives. We believed in a system that would provide regular 24 hour power supply. We believed in a system where the health system, the health structure, would bring, um, you know, Commendable changes. Commendable change. People like Nasa, our sir. Poor people will be able to have we, the we, medical care. I remember and, and during the campaign they promise. They and, and I remember during the campaign, campaign, campaign promise. During this administration, there's been a lot of unemployment. Yeah. A lot, okay. massive sack in there's the back been, of the Excuse me. You are right about the tone. In every political situation, you have the twist and tone. 